Okay guys, so I wanted to begin this vlog out with a quick story. I don't know if it's going to be quick or not, but I'm going to do a story of last Monday. Um, if you Last Monday it snowed, well, let's see, that was Thursday, I think Thursday night, like two weeks ago, it's, it didn't, it wasn't snow, it was ice, so it iced. Our job was closed Friday, so I didn't go to work Friday, Saturday, Sunday, of course. And then when Monday rolled around, I decided I was going back and forth. Crystal, you should stay home. No, Crystal, you should go to work because you need money. But it's really icy outside. Um, yeah, but you still need the money, and we're going to be way behind at work, and they need my help. Okay, so after going back and forth, um not literally like that I'm not crazy I swear um I decided to go to work so I left a little bit early I left almost an hour early and taking it slow whatever blah 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 so I get like my exit is like within one mile and then the traffic goes to a stop and I am in traffic for about 45 minutes so as I'm waiting in traffic I'm just I got my brake on because it's at a standstill pretty much and I'm next to this deal truck all I next thing I hear is a big old boom I'm like what the fuck was that freaking ice from the freaking big truck fell down on my car so I'm like, are you freaking serious, you know? So I'm like, I just was hoping my car wasn't damaged from that. And um, so after sitting for 45 minutes in traffic, I finally get to work. Um, when I go outside to check my car in the parking lot, my ass slips in the ice and I... Like, it happened so quick that I did not know what was going on. Like, I didn't know what happened. Like, and I was trying to get up, but it's all slippery. So, I'm, like, hanging on to this other car and trying to get up. And it was just so embarrassing. I, I mean, my pants and my arm right here, it was all wet. My pants was wet. So, I'm walking to work 45 minutes late. And, um... Actually, I was like 35, 30 minutes late. 30 minutes late for work. I'm wet. And I'm freezing cold. And I'm just like pissed. Like my body's aching and everything. And what else happened? I think that was it. Like my night was that day just made my it just threw off like I, I was thinking to myself I shouldn't have just stayed my butt at home so yeah that's my story so now enjoy the ice vlog okay guys so I forgot about one of the most important um part of the story there was nothing that happened I left work like four hours early because I was just so upset the whole time I was there and I was hurting a little bit so I left and I was going to go straight home but I decided to go to the store and just do some therapeutic shopping. Shopping just makes me feel so much better so I did that a little bit and did more like Christmas shopping and looking around and everything and got some stuff from Dollar Tree that I needed and um, so I, I went home and I hit traffic so it took me forever to go to to my house because I went a, a different route that I thought would end up in my house and it didn't and I was all out somewhere else so I had to turn back around and go somewhere else. I got lost and it took me about 10 minutes just to get back on track to where I needed to go. So I finally get home. Actually I went to get something to eat first because I did not want to cook and then I went home. And when I got there and when I'm about to open up the door I was looking and my keys I, ha I shouldn't have brought them in here, but my keys have, um, they're separated by this little chain, and it's my mailbox key house tree in, this, in the house.
house key and the clicker that opens up the gate. Um, so yeah, that part was missing. So what I did was search my car. So I destroyed my car, searching it for them. It wasn't in the car. And then I had called my job. They said they didn't see it. And then I called the two stores that I went to. And uh, one store said they didn't see the other store. It put me on hold um, to go look for me. And then when I, they put me on hold, my job called back and um, said that they had found it. And I was like, is it two keys in the cooker? And they were like, yes. So I was like, oh, thank you, Lord. And so, yeah. So they wasn't lost. I just dropped them um, in the parking lot at my work. So I was locked out in the cold for about a good 30 minutes until Nate got home. Um, that was not fun. And I'm glad I stopped by the stores because then I would have been probably outside for almost two hours in the cold. And keep in mind, I'm very, I'm a very cheap person. So instead of running my car and using the heat, I had my car off. I was not about to waste gas. <laughs> just to keep warm so I'm eating my food and shivering in the car until Nick got home so yeah that was my story that was my day just back to back to back things happening and like something happens which caused something else to happen which caused something else to happen um I don't know if they came off when I fell on the ground or you know I don't know but that's my story Look what we have on the car. It is starting to sleet and rain here. Supposed to do it all weekend. Um, they're closing down my job site tomorrow. So I've worked 10 hours today. And I'm hella tired because I went in early. I used to go in at um, 1, no, 2.15. 2 today I went in at 9 in the morning. And uh, I went to bed late last night and I'm just tired. Um, I didn't take any breaks, so I worked 10 hours straight, no lunch, no break, no nothing. But yeah, so yeah, Nick is uh, using a freaking red box TV to be ice the windows. Um, about to go take these back and probably get another set. It's cold here. But by my job, which is a different city as Louisville, it's icing really bad over here, over there, and it's coming this way. So we're gonna try to go to the store before it gets here, and gets way too bad, and then we can't get out, cause the wintry storm is coming. But yeah, um, I don't know how to turn the light on his car. I would show myself, but it'd probably be way too dark. I'm just showing you guys his little work with the freaking DVD case. Shake my head! All right, guys, I'll see you in a minute. So I am at, um, on the border right now with Nick. I'm about to eat. You need some salsa and chips. Okay, guys, so guys I'm going to eat the whole tree by my old apartment. And they got a small little aisle. See, it goes from makeup, hair stuff. So it's just a small little spot. But I did see something good. Where did it go? See something good. I got the magnet, Sally Hansen magnet polishers here. And all different kind of colors. My get to. And all this nail polish. But I think I'm gonna get 
some of this nail polish. Okay. So you hear the sleep coming down out here. Underneath our parking garage. Can't see. I don't think you can see my honey's car. Everybody loves his, like rams. Anyway, I'm going to side it's cold. Facebook with family. It is Friday, December the 6th, 9.30 a.m. And this is what the winter storm has left. I'm at my bedroom window looking outside. And this is not snow. This is all ice. So I'm here at Jack in the Box right now in this mess. I had to give my fiance a jump because his car wouldn't start and mine did so I gave him a jump and he's off to work in this mess and I'm at Jack in a Box Fat Girl Problems. So straight in front of me is the freeway and there's actually a lot of people, well not a lot but a couple of people that's roughing it and on the freeways today. If you see the cars, yeah, my apartments are like right by the freeway, so that's quick access to go to wherever I need to go. And I am looking a mess because I did not get ready or nothing just to come outside in the snow. If I was going to get hurt, I was going to get hurt ugly. So just waiting on my food. I was hungry. I feel like cooking. Oh, one of the nameless rabble of victims. Okay, so this is the aftermath of the storm. Right now, I think I'm in Grapevine on my way to Louisville to where I work. Um. I've been seeing a lot of like vehicles on the side roads and everything. I'm kind of scared to stay all night at work because it's going to get below freezing around 7 o'clock. And uh, all this, every, anything, on the, anything wet on the road is going to freeze over again. So I really do not want to drive in the frozen roads when I get off from work. So we're slowing down some. About to go over like a small little bridge. Look at all that ice on the side. That that is like filled up to the side railing. Yeah, so I'm on 121 South. <laughs> Headed towards Louisville where I work. Alright guys, let me uh quit and pay attention to the roads. Bye. Okay, so now I'm stuck in traffic. I was almost there to work. I was doing so good. It is... My time is a little... It's probably like five minutes fast. So it's like 1.49. As they work at 2.15. Hopefully this won't take too long at this traffic. Slowly creeping to work. I was almost there, now I'm in traffic. Do I look happy right now? No. 